Hello, Skagit Valley! <laughs> Over the course of time, mankind has spread across the earth, developing, <clears throat> developing unique cultures, languages, and body types. The divine wisdom in this process of creation that leads to such diversity within humankind is that we have a chance to get to know each other. And through that, to better know ourselves and our place in this world, and ultimately to know our Lord and Creator. The Creator looked down on this beautiful valley with all of us living together and went, oh, everyone needs to learn how to share themselves. In order to do that, they need language. And so the Creator went back and created the most beautiful languages they could think of. And they went around the earth in the direction of the sun and gave everyone all of that beauty to express their hutch, their place where their soul is with God, they, to express their joy, their beauty. All of these languages went all around the world with the Creator blessing each of us with these. And of course, since we're Skagit, when the, when the Creator got back to this valley, he says, this is where, as Grandma Vi said, the most beautiful language is going to be. And so he gave us Gadget. And I hope you've noticed that I've called the Creator he, she, and they. The earth is but one country, and humankind its citizens. Through my purpose, I found that I just want to serve. I want to serve you all. I want to serve my family, my neighbors. I want to be able to serve my community the best way possible. And going together to helping hands and participating was life-changing for me. Everybody is welcome. We are all humans. We are all struggling. If it's not apparent, when the doors are closed, people are struggling. Kindness is free. We can all afford it. We can all afford to accept and recognize people's differences and leave the judgment piece out of it. We wanna be the allies that we never had, and we're gonna do that, and so they're showing up. And I did find a bigger purpose. It was to bring people together. It was to learn more about my own Jewish identity and to learn from each other. We don't want to be on the receiving end of hate or suspicion or isolation or exclusion. So why would anyone else love your neighbor as much as you love yourself? And it's important to note that the command says to love. It doesn't say just to tolerate. Yeah. If I could, I thank each and every single one of you for being here, just like my elders and my ancestors would, by hugging you and holding you and letting you go. This is called thanking the people. So friends, given the challenges we and the planet face, it's no exaggeration to say, let's go together depends on growing into something even more. Thank you.